Now we're on. Hi, everybody. Woo. Hi. Shekalakalama. Shalom alikum. Shalom. Yeah. Shalom. 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 Oh, it's not shalakalaka. Well, that depends who you're talking to on the wall. Is this like a script that you guys did? And I shalom. <laughs> shalom. 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 Make a look at high, make a honey hole. <laughs> we learned exciting words like that today on the wall yes. around Israel. Something oh, this about is, this is backwards. Sha- something about Shabbat, Shabbos. Shabbos means Shabbos. no picture. Don't These, take a picture of me because no. I'm Orthodox and I don't like pictures. The little curly, curly you steal hair. My soul. Jew, I don't like that. Boy. But because you know what? But you know what though? Those kids were the same kids that came by the first time. The mm-hmm. seven. Yeah. I got the picture of them the first time. Yeah, that we felt. They didn't like it. Yep. You can say Jew boy here and it's not racist. But, uh, it's true. It's true. So he, I, w- I would have fit right in in high school. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So anyway, we spent like <laughs> yeah. well, we spent like four hours in the prayer room today that overlooks Mount Zion and the Mount of Olives, which was amazing. I don't even remember the name of it. Some oh. cool Hebrew word that we can't pronounce. What was it? I don't know. I can't what, what pronounce it. The, the prayer room. 24-7. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of disguised. There's a little sign by the door that says 24-7. Anyway, we had an awesome time in there, and the Lord Four really, hours. really spoke to us. Four hours. Uh, and we even interceded for the U.S. Mm. and our president, which was yes. just amazing. That was, that was unexpected. George, Old George got some serious prayer today. I yeah, mean, that powerful butt-kicking prayer, I'm sure, reached him today. Uh, we hope so. You're out of the shot. <laughs> there you go. You're right in now. So any uh, anything else big that happened today? Of course, we went out and we decided to literally walk the wall. Of the old city of Jerusalem. And that was pretty intense. Actually, yeah, it was. Of course, Jeremy was kind of our tour guide, and we discovered that he looks like Aragon. He does. Yeah. He looks like Aragon. So Aragon right. Gordon, so yes. gave us a tour today. And he, you know, Aragon actually is Strider. He's the tracker in the in the movie oh. and in the books. So that's kind of what Jeremy. Though Jeremy's today. historical facts were a li- little off in some spots. And uh, the, the whole bot bottle thing and yeah, you know, there's been any, you know two liter bottles on the tree since Jesus time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, maybe. Yeah. yeah, I guess it could have happened. But anyway, it was a very moving time seeing all the different cultures. Uh, the, the Muslims, the uh, the Armenians, Armenian Armenians, Christians, uh, some nuns, and, and, yes, and then the Jews, of course. And you know, it, it was interesting, even though these all these different religions felt like the same bondage on their lives because they're not serving Jesus. Yeah. And uh, uh, so, anyway, that was a very moving time, and uh, it took a long time. Though <laughs> we walked, we walked for about four hours total. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, uh, awesome. but it was an amazing time getting to look into the well into you the do this city. Song. It's like this. I love you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, one other thing I think that was pretty cool was the whole thing that you felt and I felt about mm-hmm. the whole war thing. We got to this one part of the wall, and I had a vision of a machine gunner dude. And Wes felt the same thing, kind of hide because there's a machine gun. Like somebody's going to shoot me in the head. Uh, it was kind of weird. So we actually prayed, and this dove showed up. We started praying Psalms 122 about the peace of Jerusalem and, uh, and within its walls. And uh, just an amazing thing. And here comes a dove. And yeah. uh, real confirmation of God uh, confirming us to declare peace. So, yeah. anyway. Right on. So it's been a good time today. We've got more stuff to come. We don't know what, except for Monday, we're going to Jericho. Yeah. But outside of that, we don't know what we're doing there, but we're going to Jericho. Crazy uh, CFNI grad invited us to go, and she doesn't even know us yet. They're starting some kind of prophetic room there, ministry thing. Some of luck. We'll see what happens there. But anyway. We're going to sign off here. Yeah, this is our debriefing for the evening. We're in our PJs chilling out uh, right out the window we look at Zion and hear the crazy call to prayer look out the window (laughs) you You see see. all the things there is Mount Zion it's very beautiful (laughs) isn't it and (laughs) and the Mount of Olives gorgeous 
Love it. Uh, actually, guys, we look like we're in an Israeli prison. <laughs> we're not. It's There's not. our window. There are also bars on the window. It's for our own protection. It's for our protection. And, and, and what you don't see there is there's a whole other shield that you pull down, so oh. if an explosion happens, Let's watch we're this. pretty cool. Here comes the shield. Whoa, check that out. That's awesome. I'm going to bring it back up, though, because it's kind of warm. So here's our room. Well, me and Wes's. There's our door, the curtain, and and then here's like us. The holies, the holies. Woo! So curtain. signing off, saying goodbye until the next time we do something. Bless you guys. We love you. Love you guys. Remember, stay strong. Yes. And peace. Shalom. <laughs>